Tell us a little bit, uh, the Navy's got their own goals, how that fits into the executive order. You've been a little bit ahead of the game in terms of putting those goals. What have you learned about how, how, uh, how you can get there and how easy is it? Okay, and like Tim said, the, the key is procurement. That, that hit the nail right on the head. We've got a very aggressive goal established by the Secretary of the Navy to get one gigawatt of renewable energy uh, by this coming December, Pro produce or procure uh, one gigawatt of renewable energy by December. And, and it's an important goal for us to hit uh, because if you think about what the mission of the Navy is, the mission of the Navy is to fight and win our nation's wars and maintain freedom of the sea. In order to do that, we need to operate from a secure environment. We need to have access to reliable and safe power, both at sea and ashore, because those ships need a pier to tie up to. So having uh, energy security is very important to us. And thanks to the Secretary of the Navy with the one gigawatt goal, it's gonna change radically the way we manage and distribute energy by integrating renewable energy in, into the process. Secretary of the Navy then appointed uh, a couple of pretty innovative leaders, uh, Secretary McGinn, who came from ACOR, who knows all about renewable energy, coupled with Mr. Bob Griffin, formerly head of NAFAC acquisition, who led the Navy's public-private uh, housing project that privatized our housing. And those, with those guys, they developed a model, a procurement model, that will enable us to get utility-scale renewable energy on our bases in a, in a way that's better, faster, and cheaper, which really hits on what Tim is trying to get us to do, is to improve the way we procure. And we, we set up three models. I like to think of the models as buy it, book it, and build it. So, so the first one is, is the buy it model. And what that is, is it's an off-base power purchase agreement in that we pay the same price for our electricity that we're currently paying at Brown Power, except it's renewable or it's, or it's less over the term of the project. In most cases, we're seeing the, the net present value of these deals to be on the positive side. So we're saving money by buying renewable energy and we're integrating renewable energy into the, the um, electric requirements of the base. And that's important because as a result of this initiative, we can't have our utility costs go up because if our utility costs go up, there's not a lot of places we can go to get more money to pay our utility bill. So oftentimes that money has to come out of our operation and maintenance, which means less money for the ships, or it comes out of our facility maintenance account. The next model is the book it model. The book it model is a real estate out grant with a, a utility partner to bring renewable energy onto, onto our secure base and push that power out to the grid. And in return for that, instead of getting rent payments, we look to get some in-kind consideration projects on the base in, in the form of energy security projects. The, the last model is the build it model, and that's a, your typical on-base power purchase agreement uh, where, we, where the power is produced on the base for our consumption. The key, the key for our success is forming strategic partnerships with the utility company and the development community. We work with companies like Duke to form a strategic partnership where we understand what their strategic goals are, they understand what our strategic goals are, and we chart a path forward and we maintain an open dialogue while we create these deals so that it creates a win-win uh, structure. Then we go to the Public Service Commission and bring them into the process so that we can all uh, achieve what our goals are. And in doing so, we found a way to integrate renewable energy into our base electric requirements so that we can change the way we manage and distribute energy and, and result in renewable energy powering our future.